Hello there and welcome to RimWorld Alpha 8 Episode 8. So you might remember in the previous episode, right at the very end, we got a nice attack dropping on us. Four people with a shiv, an M24 sniper rifle, no, uh, machine gun, M24, wrong one. The M24 is a... Where are you? Damage 45. Yeah, sniper rifle. A pistol and finally frag grenades. Now the frag grenades are the ones we are most scared of because they can do a lot of damage, especially in qu close quarters. One grenade there would wipe out most of the team. So, here's what we're going to do. We're gonna make a run for this entrance. Then try and move into positions around here where we can pick them off and run if we have to. So, everybody, down to here. Da -da 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 okay, ready? Right, let's get our guys. So, the Enfield, stand there. The Enfield, run there. The Enfield, we got a few of the Enfields. Uh, go stand there. Uh, pistol, there. And do you have no weapon? Uh, go pick up a pistol and make it quick. Whoa! Okay, uh, you. There. You. There. You. There. There. And you. Go stand there for a minute. You. Yeah, just stay where you are. Pistol. Frag grenade! Bail! Everybody out! Thank you very much. Right, so the best way to deal with this guy is melee, 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 and that's because they are so dangerous. Right, he is down. So we do the same thing here melee, melee. 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 Uh, are you running away? You are running away. Okay. Everybody. Well, you. Go stand over there. You there. And you lot. Okay, stop. Shame. We could have actually had him. How close to the map are we? Yeah, we're not going to get to him in time. Everybody return back to normal duties. Um, we actually have some bodies to deal with as well, so can we strip these bodies? Ooh, you actually did that pretty quick, didn't you? Uh, anything under there? Nope, okay. So, we're going to have to haul the bodies and deal. But first of all, who hasn't got an armoured vest? Ah, no armoured vest for you. Go and get yourself one. What are you? No armoured vest for you. Go and get yourself one. You need one as well, but I don't know if we have a spare. Uh, we don't have a spare. Okay. We have two armoured vests, so we've got them both uh, allocated now. I think, uh, do you have a parker? You... Need a parker. So, thank you. Uh, grab, yourself a, grab yourself a parker. And uh, well, you're at it, you might as well put on a hat. There we go. Right. Uh, meals. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. That's everything apart from here, but I can't see what's here. What do you have on? You have everything apart from a vest. Okay, another meal there. So, everyone's got packers? Nope, okay, packers for everyone. Go away, packer. Uh, we've got a packer around here, packer. Uh, you're wearing a packer, you have a packer, but I'm going to double check. Uh, yes, you do. And you also have a packer. Everyone's got a packer, we've just got a few people without uh, vests. But that's not a major problem right now. We are 
building up a list of bodies right now, so I'm going to need a crematorium soon to help deal with these bodies. But we can get back to full speed now. Dun, 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 dun. Um, okay, what are you doing? Hauling a body. Yeah, I'd, right in the very second, I would rather you haul that body. Get the bodies out of the way so we don't have to worry about them too much. And then we can focus on the other stuff. Andy, for example, is doing the limestone walling for everybody. Because that limestone wall took that impact really well. So we're going to need to do that. I'm going to leave the internal walls of wood. If a fire starts, the fire starts. Not much we can do about it, really. But it gives us a great uh, option. So. Uh, diddly, diddly, diddly. diddly. Yes, these are limestone, I believe. Yes. So we are actually waiting for limestone to complete. And um, we're keeping the place nice and warm. It's a oh yeah, they broke a door down, didn't they? Uh structure. We need a door. And I'm happy for a wooden door to go in that spot. We don't really need uh, anything stronger on the these main doors. Mm, we've got steel doors there. Steel's fine. How's our research? What are we researching? Pneumatic picks, good. So, everybody's doing their jobs and we are progressing nicely. We do have bodies on the outside here. We were nicely uh, decaying. Uh, weapons. Pistol. I think we can upgrade you to an M24. Anybody else got a pistol? We can. Ooh, sniper rifles. M24. Thinking about it, we'll keep a couple of people on pistols. Better idea. Everyone. Could you please all congregate here? I have a request. Thank you. So, who's good at shooting? Character. Shooting, six. You go stand there. Shooting, three. You go stand there. Five. Seven. And five. Okay, so you get a pistol. You can go away. You lot are actually pretty decent. So who's got the best out of that? Because I've got three people at Lee Enfields right now and I have two decent sniper rifles. So who's got the best shooting ability? Seven. There. Uh, six. Five. And five. Well, there we go. You. Go get yourself an M24. As you undraft, M24. Undraft, M24. You two get to keep what you've got now. Uh, yes, yeah, so I've got three long range, two short range. And uh, that'll do us quite nicely. The short range pistols actually have a uh, much better firing speed as well. So uh, yeah, that uh, that helps a lot. What have we got? Some travellers passing by. Uh, this is going to be quite a lot of steel, so I'm just going to dig to there for now. Don't want to open this up fully. Okay. Thank you. Growing zones going nicer still. Although I think we did lose a fair amount of it. Uh, can we please chop wood around the base just to keep keep this area clear? And most importantly, this area. Just want to keep this area clear from bad guys. I'm trying to high brain stuff. What's this anyway? Shallow water, marsh water. Okay. So guys, what are you doing? Uh, walking around randomly. Pneumatic picks have been researched. Yay! Um, we are now in need of. Ooh. Yeah. Give me some cremation. I do actually want to put a decent defensive area up, and I'm going to start building that really soon. Um, actually I want to have the guys here, so we can plan that out now. Structure. Wall. Uh, let's not. Who's crafting? Who's our major crafter? Crafter, crafter, crafter. Uh, Andy is, and he's currently mining. That is why he's uh, not crafting the stone for us. This is fine. Uh, let's get. So I turn them off for a reason. Everyone gets light, apart from the bed Mysterious blight destroys your crops. Absolutely perfect. Thank you very much. Apart from that one. 
We got one piece of geranium, not not dying. So I'm thinking if we can open this up as like a kill zone, get the enemy to come around here and walk into a trap. We'll be near perfect. We have to come this that bit outside we're gonna be outside the kill zone though. We have nice little kill boxes set up for long range defence. But they're only gonna be good for short term really. So what to do? Because I really don't want the bad guys coming around, walking through that door there, when I've got a kill box up here. So we'll have to wall off the base and say this is the entrance. So I don't have a problem with. But I have this beautiful area here for the defensive point. Because it's so clear. No trees can grow on it, I don't have to worry about levelling it, and it slows them down. Brilliant. I think if I put double doors and then put the kills on, they'll uh, come through this naturally. Yeah, doesn't sound like a bad idea actually. We need a lot of uh, slate building up because we're going to do this in proper walling because it'll take it harder for them to get through. But yeah, I'm not, uh, not bad about that actually. And there they are, replanting the crop. I don't know if it's a good idea to replant the crop or not. They might all freeze anyway. What's this? Growing zone for cotton. Yes, cotton. And we have a bulk goods trader. Okay. I always forget who it is. Who is it? Uh, eight and seven. Suskind, before you go to bed, could you please have a chat with the bulk goods trader? Hello, bulk goods trader. Convenient import company. Great name. Okay, what have we got? Limestone blocks. Wood. We can sell them quite a lot of wood. We don't need to worry about that. So we'll sell you... Oops, sorry. Red Dwarf theme tune there. Sell you all that, because I actually want to buy some limestone blocks just to accelerate the, uh, the growth. But, before we do anything like that, Anything we actually really need. Slate, limestone, uranium, berries, they can have medicine. Expensive. But we do need some and we have nine, so we'll actually leave that alone. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Can't sell any of them to you, so we will buy some of your limestone blocks, please. And we'll buy 300. There we go. Thank you, come again. And they'll be able to immediately go up here and get these defences up and running, defence areas. And then we can then focus on getting our uh, main area running. So here we goes. Go get those little bits done. And then we can... What's this? This is set to do me 48 more stone blocks of a limestone. And one of anything. Suspend. Do, 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 do. Another hundred please. Go. Oop. We have... Someone's got flu. Okay, you've got the flu. I'm gonna have to take care of you on that one. Uh, health. Flu. Minor. Untreated. 34%. Okay. And we have a group of pirates besieging the colony. Oh god, I hate besieging. Uh, just to see what we have to deal with anyway. Gear. Incendiary launcher. Nice. Pistol, Molotov, pop shotgun, M16, and Incendiary. So actually, nothing long range. That's interesting. They're quite a way away. But they don't have any long range weapons. I might take somebody with a long range weapon up there just to see if we can uh, cheese them off a little bit. Yes. Although it's going to be a good opportunity to replace these internal walls as well. So, uh, you, what are you doing? You're going to eat? Look, if you can go eat something, and then we'll send you out a nice little uh, hunting run. Okay, recruited. Could you 
Go stand there. Okay, normal speed, let's have a quick gander. What is the range of your weapon? B. Okay, so if I ask you to go stand there... Can you see anyone? No. B. We need to get a bit closer. B. Bit closer. B. Bit closer. Right, there you definitely should be able to see people, and you can! Wow, you shot a wild boar. Any chance you can shoot this guy? Because he's got a guy right behind him. Chances are you'll hit the guy behind him. No? Okay. Oh, the guy behind him, right out of range. Uh, go stand there. Go shoot him. Good, got one. Wow. E pull back, pull back. They're assaulting the colony. Evade, run, run. Uh to there. You two. Recruit to there. Um, I'm sure Jupiter. Could you actually help with the fires? Really? The one person who I could have done with being a firefighter. Okay, Ripley. Uh, yeah. Fight the fires, Andy. What are you doing? You are actually fighting the fire right now. Good. Could you do it faster? Good. Go, 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 go! Before we just check. They are coming, and they are coming slowly. Good. Um, Ripley. Head up there. Because I've got uh, Andy doing all the firefighting right now. It's not a problem. Okay, Andy, recruiting time. Get your bun up here. Suskind is now being chased. Uh, what's this? We have a bulk ghost trader. Okay. Okay, they're coming down this way. So everyone with big long range weapons. Could you please move yourselves into a firing position? Thank you. Uh, Andy? Yeah, I thought you might have a long range weapon. Go stand there, please. Uh, where are you going? Good. Pistol. Go stand there. Pistol. Go stand there. I'm just getting one of the pistols up close just to make sure we get some shots early. Yeah, that's not good. Pistol. There. Pistol. Uh, there. Andy. There. Breaking up our fire here. What he has Molotovs. Warning, Molotovs. Andy. What's down there? There. 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 Andy! Sniper rifle guy! Go stand there! Jupiter! Go stand there! Ripley! Yep, you can go stand there! Can we please focus on the guy with the Molotovs? Fire! You can't hit that target, okay. Uh, I don't really care about the guy with the pistol this very second, so go stand there! Oh, top incoming! You go stand there. You've got a good shot anyway. Uh, they're using our own defences against us, people. Look, 
Uh, go stand. Well, go stand there. Could you? Yeah. Everyone is to attack as soon as they get a shot. Farming solution. Good. Anybody else we have to worry about? Just the one, and he is actually incapacitated, so he must have been hit by our uh, sniper. Good, good. Right, everyone else, could you please put out the fires? They are a priority. As for you, we have bodies. Uh, any gear that's decent? Not really there. Ooh, got, got a cowboy hat. We have a potential prisoner as well. I will point that out. We have a potential prisoner. Is he any good? And he's got a left leg shot off, so he needs some. He can't do a lot of stuff. Uh, he can't he can't do skills or hauling, so he can shoot, which is crap at anyway. Millie, which is not too bad. Social, he's okay. Medicine, crap. So we don't really want him. So here's what we're gonna do. We are going to try and make these guys friendly with us. Ooh, is this guy alive? He is. We got a prisoner here. How are you gonna do? Uh, left leg shot off. Good. We've got two people with shot off legs. That's nice. He is incapable of nothing, he's fast, warm skinned, construction going da, 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 da. Okay, I could do with this guy hanging around because he's got decent crafting learning ability. Social melee. Okay, so I have Jupiter, before you go and get yourself some rest, could you capture this guy? We have no prison cells. Okay. We have five beds, so I am going to turn that one and that one into prison cells. Jupiter, primary task. Capture. Uh, Andy, what's your thoughts? Yeah, could you, hang on, health, peg legs. Nope, you're not going that far. Andy! Yep, you're alright. Could you please go and capture me a uh, cattle? Like, cattle? Yeah, cattle. Please? And, yep, I'm happy with that. If you could head up there, let those guys deal with the fire around our facility, and we'll pick up the stuff. Dun 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 dun. So the fire's nearly out, and could you go and strip that body? Could you go and strip that body? And then. Could you haul that body? And then haul that body. And that is all we need to do there. So, uh, next thing we need to do anybody who is not wearing a parker needs to go get a parker. We have a couple of spare. You do, and you're injured, so that's good. You do. You do. You do. Does everyone there's got a parker apart from Andy? No, everyone's got parkers. Good. It's the armored vest we were short on. Uh, we've got a couple of helmets needed, but th that'll deal with. Okay, go. All those bodies. And then go see to yourselves. Ooh, who's our medic, by the way? Marson and Jupiter. Uh, Jupiter's currently del uh, incapacitated, so Marson, good on you. Before you go and do anything like that, could you actually heal him? Because his health will get him on the back of his feet, he can feed himself. What were his injuries anyway? Health, uh, blood loss, gunshot, yeah, okay, I'm happy with that. Right, uh, da -da -da -da. yeah, and now Jupiter, if you would please heal Marson from his horrific injuries of flu. And gunshot, we can uh, maybe stem that flu. That flu is going to be a big issue for us if we don't deal with it. Uh, right, we've got to deal with these guys. Now, we got seven medicine, there'll be six medicine, and these two have missing legs. So, I'm going to actually install peg legs in both of them. It may sound odd, uh, but we're going to do that, so left leg. Install left peg leg. And you, left leg, install left peg leg. Now, it does sound a bit unusual. These guys do come from. Follow me. Wasp's Stream. And they. 
Wasp's stream. Uh, minus 92. Now, I figure if we release one of their people, they might not like the haters as much. So, medical. We are in need of it for these people. So, oh, we can tell Brick on Masson. Uh, why? Urgently hungry. Well, you know what you can do about that, mate? You know, you can eat that yourself. Okay, Marson. Uh, two. You, you see to yourself first. Okay, Marson. You're not a doctor anymore. Good on you. Right. Here's what we're going to do with these two. We are going to go to... Uh, prioritize operation. Marson. You're not going to break anymore. Good. Could you... You're not... Oh, you're not a doctor anymore. One, thank you. Could you... Also, prioritize this operation. So they both have them, their uh, legs back. There we go. I'm going to take this medical facility. Make that one not medical. Just give somebody a uh, bed, because we do need one. Oh, I took two, did I? Yeah. Uh, yeah, sure. We need a, the bed for people. Okay. Now, these guys. Prisoner. Um, we're going to keep one of them. Not keeping him, he can do barely anything. And we're going to keep him. So, cattle. Uh, prisoner. Release. Marson. We can't do anything about that at the moment. What's he, what's he carrying anyway, gear wise? Armoured vest. Yes, he's the uh, most definitely getting himself dealt with here. Uh, health. Wait for that anaesthetic to go away. What have we got? Paula. That's uh, got an infection. Thought that might happen. Since we do actually want Paula, we will be giving you medicine. Uh, are you awake yet? Because I want to... I want to get you out of here. Wake up! Wake up! Okay, you're not going to wake up this episode. So, we're going to have to leave it there for this episode. We'll, we'll be releasing cattle back to the uh, pirates. Hopefully they'll like us a bit better for it. We're going to recruit Paula because we could do the extra colonists. And I did the calculations and we have enough food to support six people. So, yay! So, uh, as usual, comments in the comments. Thanks for watching and we'll uh, see you next time. Also, if you're not already a subscriber, please consider subscribing.